today I'm filming this video. I'm talking a little bit quieter and the lighting is a little bit weird because it is like 12.15 in the morning and I'm filming this and my roommates are asleep next door. Since I only have my light, I can't use natural lighting because it's nighttime here. Um, but I'm kind of try still trying to figure things out so I'm not sure. I kind of, to me, I think I look a little orangey. Um, but I'm learning this camera so I have apologize for the weird lighting. Anyway, the main reason I wanted to film this video at like 12.15 at night. One, because I just got home from my parents' house and I could not sleep once I got home. And two, because I got this in the mail. And this month was Hogwarts house. And they pick a house and they send it to you. And I am in the group on Facebook, like a Owl Crate Society group on Facebook. And a lot of people have been posting that they got their sorting house. Um, and a lot of people got Ravenclaw, Gryffindor, and Slytherin. But nobody in there posted that they got Hufflepuff. Which made me kind of excited because I feel like maybe I will. Because the, the thing for this box was that they were just going to randomly sort you into houses. They weren't going to like p take like suggestions or picks for which box you were. Which was kind of irritating, but also like makes total sense because what if there's like 80 million Gryffindors and like two Slytherins, then you just bought all the Slytherin stuff for nothing. Um, so that makes sense. I'm hoping that if I don't get Hufflepuff, one of the people in that group will swap with me for Hufflepuff. But the first thing I find is this, and it says, Happiness can be found even in the darkest of times if one only remembers to turn on the light. One of my favorite quotes from Harry Potter. Um, and then it says, what's inside your cube, November 2016, and I'm not going to read this, obviously, the spoilers. I'm just going to put that down. Um, and it's purple paper. I know some of the things that are in here, because they kind of spoiled us, but you don't know, like, what house you got. So, let's see. So the first thing I see is this owl post letter here. I wonder if it tells me. I did a really good job of keeping it a secret. Um, what house you got right away? And this is... Nerdy Girl Designs is the card here, and it says... Magnetic bookmarks and planner stickers. And so these are some Harry Potter, cute Harry Potter planner stickers. There's like Harry and Voldemort. Um, and there's like all of the little cute people over there. Can you see that? Yep, now you can. It's just super cute. And what is this? These are some nail glams, and they're Harry Potter, so of course I'm going to use these. Like, probably soon. I wish I would have had this to go to the movie. I would have used it. They're still really cool. But I got a Slytherin one. It says, or perhaps in Slytherin you'll make your real friends. Those cunning folk use any means to achieve their ends. So that's really cool. And if you open it up, it's like a really nice planner. Which I might actually use. Um, but I might post in the book and see if anyone got... Hufflepuff that wants to trade me for Slytherin. Um, but I'm a little bummed. I believe this is a scarf thing. I'm it. This is kind of cool though. It's got like a bunch of Slytherin words on it like cunning, power, leadership, fraternity, ruthless, pure, self preservation, traditionalism. Ambition, driven, like it's got a bunch of words on it. It's a really cool scarf. Um, I wonder what the Hufflepuff one says. Ooh, what's this? This is some stick candy here. Rum and butter. Stick candy. It's just a yellow stick. It's kind of cool. From Gilliam. And then the book here is called. The League of Beastly Dreadfuls, which is really cool. Um, it's time to read the card. It says, Readable, The League of Beastly Dreadfuls by Holly Grant. A creepy Victorian house, secretive aunties, and a great ex escape. 
combine in this debut that is part Mysterious Benedict Society and part Wild Doll and all quirky, smart, hilarious storytelling join the league. So that's really cool. Wearable is your house scarf. Um, exclusively designed and manufactured for Lightkeep subscribers. Show your house pride with this lovely, high-quality scarf. So I'll wear it if I can't find anyone better trade with me. Packable is old-fashioned candy sticks. We can imagine the Weasley twins selling these to students on campus. Did you get root beer or butter beer? So I got rum and butter, so I'm assuming that's butter beer. That's cool. Um, then you get exclusive house handbook organizer. Designed and manufactured just for our subscribers. This is a really expensive item. The organizer stickers and the themed nail decals. So that's really cool. I can see why people are kind of upset that they don't do like house catering because if you want to wear the scarf but you're like not that house, I can see why that would be obnoxious. Um, and I actually only have like a bracelet and a hair bow that are Hufflepuff. I don't have a Hufflepuff scarf, which I really want one. Um, so hopefully someone can trade with me. Um, yeah, that's everything I got in this box. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like the video um, if you enjoyed it. Make sure to leave a comment down below if you also got this box. And if you got Hufflepuff and you want to switch or like do a three-way switch like if there's you got a Hufflepuff and your friend got something needs a Slytherin or something like if there's somehow if we want to switch let me know and I will um, you can leave a comment down below and I will connect with you on that or if you have heard of someone who wants to switch for Slytherin or someone who has a Hufflepuff blah 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 just if you know of anyone or if you personally want to switch let me know um, also make sure to subscribe if you have not. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!